Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and those who are neither. I'm Ramblin' Rusty Elm, and you're watching Ramblin' with Rusty, Starfield Edition. Last time on Ramblin' with Rusty, Starfield, we stopped in at Constellation to speak with Sam Coe and met him and his daughter, Cora, and started the Empty Nest storyline. We then proceeded to uh, stop in at the Den in the Wolf System, where we dropped off a pair of boots before heading out to find a place to collect copper so that we can fulfill our contract to Demos. And then finally made our way over to Aquila City in Cheyenne, where we have just learned that there is a bank robbery in progress. We now pick up the story where we left off. I doubt those robbers are going to let us leisurely peruse the Galbank vault. You better see if we can help move this situation along. If you make a move toward the building, a hostage dies. You planning to tell me your demands you at some point? A joke. You find someone we can trust, and maybe we will. Like who? Not you, not one of your rangers, and not these city guards, neither. <sighs> supposed to do with that you need to stand back now yeah. sounds like you could use a little help there Marshall I don't mean to be rude but I don't know you now please stand back Aquila City at its finest I see never a dull moment well, I'll be damned. Sam Cole. Been a long time. I won't hold my breath about you being here to take the badge again. Uh, <laughs> listen, Sam, just so you know, I don't blame you for how it went down. For the others, though, you might get a different reception. Thanks. I appreciate you saying so. But I figure some of that reception is owed. Still, I appreciate the sentiment, Marshal. It seems you got a situation. My friend here may be the answer you're looking for. All right, Sam. I'll trust your judgment on this one. Some folks from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage, and now they're keeping a watch so we can't move against them. They're using the intercom to communicate. Uh, must have made some They won't by talk now. to me say they don't trust the badge <laughs> they want a neutral negotiator in other <laughs> words they didn't have a plan for this so they're stalling while they come up with one mm. it might come to that but first I just want you to talk to them find out what they want and then report back to me take it slow and steady look for every opportunity to de-escalate you got this Hey, okay. You in the bank. I'm sending in a negotiator, so don't shoot. Hands where I can Things see. You got a little excitement on your hands. Well, we'll give it a try their way. You're the negotiator, huh? If you think you're just going to walk up here and get us to surrender, you're dead wrong. Yeah. This only works we'll if you're cooperate and we get what we want. So tell me, stranger, how do I know you're gonna deal straight with us? <laughs> I don't know you, so why should your word mean anything to me? Well, uh, you know, talking to me. Is the only way you're getting out of here alive, but I'm sure, yeah. I ain't buying it. Well, I get it. You're not taking any chances, but it's me or no well, one. I guess you have a point. Uh, let's see. I'm not on anyone's side here. It doesn't change the fact that you're surrounded and trapped. Uh, 
I don't think I want to go with belligerent, so we'll go here. Keep flapping your lips. You ain't changing my mind. Nothing you say is gonna change my mind, so let's just move on. Okay. Uh, they talk too damn much. Complain about <laughs> everything. But as much as we'd like to, none of us has shot one yet. Uh, Got a real attitude problem, don't you? Well, you better listen up. We want to guarantee a safe passage to the spaceport and a ship. We'll drop the hostages off somewhere safe in the system. After that, we'll radio back where they are, and the marshal and his crew can come and get them. You guys but don't really us, think they're going to pull orbit, we start let that people. shit go, do you? There ain't a law enforcement agency in existence that would accept that. Eh, but, uh... That's a pretty tall then order. persuade the marshal that it ain't. <sighs> this whole damn job's gone wrong. It was supposed to be just a quick hit. Clean and simple, you know? So let's just... Let's all try to keep our heads, yeah? Because my guys, they're going crazy in here. I don't know how much longer we can last. Hmm... Yeah. What do you mean? Damn it. I didn't think. Let's see. Let's see if you let the uh, gets hurt we won't have to rot in jail for the rest of our lives yes uh, yeah looks like that we'll do this one worse. point at a time uh, if the hostages die it'll be the marshal's fault for not taking us seriously nah it's too late to back out now we're seeing this through well, you go tell it was the marshal to get that ship ready so we can all walk away from this thing without anybody getting hurt. Well, I tried, Marshal. The shark gang's making fools of us all. I heard every word. He's talking too loud. Sign of fatigue. All that fear and exhaustion are taking a toll. They're not thinking straight. That puts us in a very precarious position. Now nah, you'd be wasting your time. Or worse, it'd make them angry. No sense risking that. I appreciate your idealism. But there were only ever two ways this could end. You've already ruled out one of them, so that leaves us with only one option. We have to free the hostages by taking out their captors. Problem is, they're keeping me and the guards in sight at all times. If we try to move against them, they'll see us coming. You'd be willing to do that? You've got guts, that's for damn sure. I'm I can't deny that you're right, you. though. They might not see that coming. Now, I see two ways we can play this. You could ask to see the hostages. And once you're inside, you can make your move. If you're quick, I think you can take them out before they have a chance to respond. But you'll have to shoot to kill. There's also a back door. Most of their attention's focused out front here, so they may not be watching it as closely. This key should unlock it. Well, I, I don't see the asking for a hostage to work out. Asking to see the hostages. I'm gonna do this.
suppressed gun. Missed. Thought you could hide, huh? Let's see if we can push the situation at Galbank along a bit. Let's do it. Spectacle, isn't it? They've got the marshal by the balls. I heard the fight. The hostages, are they safe? Hostages are fine. And the jug ain't not so much, yeah. Is that so? Shame it had to come to that. But you got the job done and saved lives. Here, you've more than earned this. You got us out of a tough spot and you did it with courage that's not common. As a matter of fact, you might just be Freestar Ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to the Rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new recruits. Yeah, we'll definitely be doing that here in a little bit. Yeah. All right. Now that lives aren't on the line, let's get back in Galbank, see if we can get those maps. Sounds good to me. They told me to go home, but I'm not missing a moment of this. It's okay. Bodies are still there. All right. The family has a few different deposit boxes secured in here, so let's look around. Here's a copy of the key. Okay, now remember, Solomon was from an earlier generation, so it's not going to be on a slate. Big bundles of paper is what we're after. Okay, so I also need to change my, uh... Empty... Uh, Alright, let's see. Let's see... I think it's in this one. No. Must be in this one, then. Nope, for Sam. Sam. There you are. Oh, no. Jacob. Of course that old mule saw this coming. Mm. Eh. I'm walking into drama. You're gonna be like this, this the whole drama. way? <laughs> Damn it. I was hoping to avoid the estate. Cora's gonna be so mad. Uh... Yeah, 
we could take a break. Let Trust me. In the, dark the last thing I want to do is think more about it. Let's just get going. Okay. Off we go. Well, well. Sam Cole finally decides to darken our doorstep again. You know why I'm here. Oh? And what's that? You come to your senses? Realize where you ought to be for once? I ain't asking again. You ain't asked once. Let's hear it. I want you to say the words about what's more important to you than family. Okay, this was a mistake. The only mistake I'm seeing here is you. Bringing your constellation lackey here instead of my granddaughter. Come to help Sam loot his ancestry? You're not getting those maps. Full stop. There's only one place a co ought to be. And it ain't out there in the star field doing Lord knows what. Putting our future at risk. I got just as much right to those maps as anyone else in this family. That's exactly right, Sam. We all share Solomon's legacy. Only some of us are around to live up to it, and some of us aren't. All right, that's enough. Come on, let's you and I talk. In private. Hmm. Welcome home, Sam. Make your visit short, okay? It's what you do. Any day you make it through is a victory in my book. Give me a sec. <sighs> All right, let's talk options. You're flying in the face of my 30 plus years experience with the man, but all right. I hope you like arguing. Sam's constellation lackey here to bother me again? You mean besides the fact that you're some independent group that doesn't know where your loyalties lie? Or are you referring to the fact that my granddaughter lives in your clubhouse rather than in her family home? Well, that's not your decision, is it? It's co-property by birthright. It stays here. You really believe that, don't you? I can't believe I'm saying this, but if I get you out of my hair, then fine. Wow. You can have the maps. There that is the, the here. first Keep. persuasion check I have ever succeeded at on either character. Okay. Well. All right. Let's see if we can find the empty nest. All right, let me think. The way I heard it, the readings he was getting were normal at first, then they bottomed out. And no creature, alien or otherwise, would dare step inside. There. Found it. Oh, boy. <sighs> That's a problem. We'll be fine. Just gotta take a look at what we're up against. First, it's in the middle of the frontier, which we already expected. No problems there, but the usual tussling with alien wildlife. But the empty nest is a cave right in the middle of Shawgang territory. Same outlaws who held up Galbank. Yeah, well... Hey, if they're willing to trade, all the better. But the Shawgang is a uh, shoot-first kind of outfit. All right, time's a-wasting. Let's get to that cave. Yeah, let's. Uh... You 
have what you wanted. Now off with you. Okay, okay. Let's see. It says we gotta go that way. A mirror wolf at the low house could really use someone helpful like you. After the job you did with the bay. City. Ah. Well, it's just a short run. Okay, so. Flavor of smuggler lives here. Oh, maybe yeah, cherry vanilla. Okay, so. Say good night. Today's not gonna be your day, pal. Never mess with a cold. Games.
Shepard? What was that? Yeah, Sam's back on his feet. There's turret over there, huh? It's on the other side of those buildings. Well, I mean, I was willing to try and talk to them, but they just started shooting, so. Oh, wait a minute, we needed to be over here anyways. Looting the dead ain't glamorous, but it sure is profitable. Came in from over here. So Shaw Game Robot, Shaw Game Member, Shaw Game Member. Oh, bad water. Okay. Look easy. Well, when I find you, when you find me, what? Can't fool me. We got no. company. Ah! One down. Where? Okay. Well, I think that about wraps up that part of the show game. Smugglers are as common as fleas. Take 
that. Ooh, credits, of course. So what do we have here? Jack, King, King, Jack, two pairs. Three, seven. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and eat those while we're here. What do we got over here? Queen of Diamonds, Jack of Hearts, Nine of Spades, Ace of Spades. Just set off a mine or something. I wonder what sort of contraband these smugglers are running. You know they have cargo holds for all that. I do, but I gotta get it to the cargo hold first. in my throat there so we're going to leave it here for this episode and next time we will head into the cave recover the artifact and then head back to town but for now I'm Ramblin' Rusty Elm have a good day and don't forget to stop and smell the roses